For more videos, visit ForTheSakeOfEducation.com Alright guys, let's do this problem where we got all these forces acting on this plate and all these forces notice that they are going only on the x-axis and they basically want you to replace this by one single force acting on one single uh, point on this plate so you know that the sum of the forces let's assume going down is positive are equal to 100 plus 200 plus 100 plus 200 which will give us a total resultant force of 600 newtons now the moment creating on this plate about the x-axis let's assume going kind of clockwise is positive some of the moments in the x is equal to the 100 on the left times 3 this distance so this 3 times this 100 plus 200 times 1 which is this 200 right here times this distance of 1 plus 200 times 1 again for this one right here 200 times 1 minus 100 times 3 which comes out for a total moment of 400 newton meters going uh, counterclockwise so you know that the moment at x is equal to the resultant force times the y now this y is going to be the, the distance between here and somewhere around here y to the left because the plate is turning counterclockwise so a force has to be acting on the left not on the right so this will be 400 which is the moment which is calculated times the resultant force which is 600 times the y so the y comes out to be negative 0.667 meters now it's a negative because again it's to the left since the moment is going counterclockwise now we're going to do this whole same process but for the y let's assume again that counterclockwise is positive so counterclockwise is positive the sum of the moments in the y is equal to 100 times 3 plus 100 times 3 for these two 100 newton forces at a distance 3 from the y plus 200 times 2 for this one right here and this distance of 2 minus 200 times 3 minus 200 times 3 so this moment comes out to be 400 newton meters again now you know that the for the same process the moment on the y is equal to the resultant force times the distance in the x again it's going kind of clockwise so the distance in the x is going to be this way to the left of y so the moment is 400 the resultant force is 600 x is x when you solve for x you get it's the exact same thing 0.667 except that this time is positive because it's on the positive plane of the x so it will be a negative 0.667 and positive 0.66 and the resultant force will be acting somewhere around here on this plate to be an equivalent resultant force so this is the y coordinate x coordinate and the resultant force is 600 newtons obviously going down because all the forces are going down final answers Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.